Hey guys, this is Vecu786 bringing you my fourth video modding tutorial. Now in this video, I will show you how to mod Infinite World. Now you already know the basics on how to sw uh, swap characters and how to use textures in Buddha Guy 3 if you have already seen my previous tutorials. Now in this, I will show you the basic concepts of how Infinite World is different than Buddha Guy 3. The concepts are very simple and most uh, you guys will enjoy it when you start uh, editing it. Now first of all uh, you need uh, an ISO file for your infinite world game. If you wa if you already have the ISO file then uh, you can move on. If you don't have one then you have to use the LC ISO creator. The link uh, for it uh, will be in my first video and I want you to use it and make the ISO file if you have a disk for infinite world. Now that you have an uh, infinite world uh, as an ISO file, I want you to extract data uh, underscore cmn dot uh, there's a link for the li uh, bin files for infinite world uh, in the description below now use it uh, f uh, to find your characters now remember in infinite world the 3d model and its textures are in two separate files that's right in uh, budokai 3 it was one uh, single file but infinite world it is uh, completely two different files now if you can uh, go through the list uh, let's take pan for an example uh, in the in the list uh, the slot number for pan is 5 uh, 567 which means that this is the texture file that's right if we go uh, if we open a uh, if you want to swap pan uh, with someone else you need to uh, take both 566 which will be the 3d model and 567 which is the texture model uh, texture file okay and extract it and you can replace it with someone else the files uh, the bins in this i will repeat again uh, the files in the, this list are for textures only the file the uh, the bin file right before it is the 3d model okay now here's an example as you can see in 566 there is nothing but it is it does belong to pan but if you see 567 all the textures for pan are there uh, if you want to swap uh, swap these characters, you can uh, refer to my second video, uh, to, uh, second tutorial, which is on how to swap characters in Budokai 3. It is basically the same thing, but uh, only Infinite World you have to swap two uh, two different uh, bin files for it to happen. I made this tutorial so that uh, you, uh, I can teach you on how to import Infinite World models into Budokai 3. That will be my next tutorial. So have fun uh, watching. Uh, Super Baby Vegeta 2 uh, training. Bye.